So, hi there. My name is Alenson and Orozco and I'm came from from my mother. Okay, man. Cut, 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 cut. Rolling sound production take two. So, good day everyone. I am Alenson and Orozco from 1EEA and today's vlog I will discuss the positive and negative effects of globalization to our culture as well evidence and my personal experiences with it. So let's get started. Well we all know that the benefits of globalization can be found all over the world. However along with the advantages of globalization come disadvantages that have an impact not just on the lives of those who benefit from it but also on our future. I will be discussing first the positive and negative effect and its evidences and after that my personal experiences. For number one, the country will be known for its own culture. Because globalization connects the whole world, it's easier for it to spread the culture of a country to different parts of the world, especially with the help of technology. Example of that is using of social media. For number two, oh, two joints! Don't panic, it's organic. Two joints! For number two, it's easier for the new generation to learn Asian culture whenever they are. Globalization and technology are intervened because of these two. It is easier for you to learn the Asian culture if they want to study it even the history of a country. An example of this is using Google for finding information or asking other people question using a cell phone. Development of the country. If the country is known for its culture, the whole country will surely prosper and its economy will be also prosper. For example, Filipinos are known for being hospita hospitable. So foreign are encouraged to come to the Philippines, visit tourist spots, here and also enjoy and buy our product. Number four, people are becoming more aware of Asian culture. Because of technology and globalization, the information is easier to spread all over the world. It is easier for everyone to become aware of our culture. It will be easier for us to learn about our cultures that is still unfamiliar to us if we want to. Number five, number five, we discover the new talents, art, and other that is related from our culture. Because in modern times, ideas of other countries can also be applied to our own culture and costume to produce our discover new talent, art, and other that are still related or inspired to our culture and we are already done on the positive effect now let's proceed to the negative effect first we adapt other culture it is unavoidable that we have a similarities with other countries or we will be compared to other it may be in the aspect of religion the way of living language or anything else and example of this is being conyo of filipino so the second is the asian culture can be erased because we are influenced by the other culture of the other countries so in the modern times we are 
influenced by the culture of other countries. We think that their culture is more interesting to learning and we enjoy learning their culture more than our own. Due to that, our own culture can be replaced by the other. An example of this is a Filipino who has a more knowledge about other countries than to his own. Discrimination. If the Asian culture is changed, people's values and behavior will also change. This is also where the discrimination of Filipinos living in a modern way against other Filipinos who live in a harmony with the Asian culture begins. An example of this is the, the discrimination of others to the people who believe the superstition others think they are weird or crazy. Number four, Filipinos may enjoy the culture of others more than their own culture because of globalization it's easier for us to know how unique culture of other countries is we become more interested in it and as a result we enjoy their culture more an example of this is the purchase of spicy noodles by Filipino which is popular in Korea because it is trend of number five Migration. If Filipinos see that the culture of other countries is better than their livelihood, will develop faster there, they will be encouraged to live and work there. An example of this is a family migrating to Canada because of its strong economy providing numerous opportunities and culturally diverse population. So, for my real life experience, I can say that as a student, I've also experienced some positive and negative effect of globalization to culture. For the positive, I will admit that I do not like to read of any books, especially about history. But because of the election, I was encouraged to research using Google due to globalization and technology. I've discovered a lot of a new knowledge regarding to history, culture, politics, and more, and that I cannot read in a book. And I also became more aware of how life was different than from now in terms of culture, way of living, community, prices, and so on. On the negative side, I mentioned I will not admit that I'm also one of a Filipino once became more interested <laughs> in culture of other than my own culture. But lately I realized that I as a Filipino I must love and learn my country country's culture because I cult culture become learning and adapting other. So again this is Alison Orozco from 1EEA and I would like to thank you for your time and appreciation. 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 Thank you for watching.